What's up guys, it's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to add and use or customize the icon specs present on the Revolution Slider WordPress plugin, okay? So let's imagine that you would like to have some icon into your Slider Revolution plugin, okay? Into the slider and you need to learn how to add this and this is what we're gonna learn today. But before we can start, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button, like this video and share this content with a friend of yours. You have no idea how much it helps us, okay? So, before we can start, take a second to do this and let's go to our WordPress dashboard, okay? I always like to start the videos on dashboard so we can make it equal for everyone. So, once on dashboard, let's screw your page down so you can screw the left side of menus down until we can find the slider revolution options it used to be one of the latest menus into the left sidebar click on it before this make sure that you have the slider revolution plugin properly installed and activated okay and let's get it got we already have some previously made sliders okay so we can edit Hover your mouse over the slider, click on the edit icon, okay, this pencil icon, and you're gonna be able to edit the slider. Here is one ex slider example. Let me move it just a little bit down. And now, from this, we're gonna be able to apply an icon. How to do this? First of all, review the top bar of your screen, and we have a little plus icon next to the WordPress icon, okay? These three icons at the upper left corner. And if you hover your mouse over it, you're gonna be able to see text, image, button, shape, video, audio, and icon. We're gonna be looking for the icon or SVG. A window gonna pops up so we can choose the icon. We have some icon packs, for example, font awesome, material icons, and stroke icon 7. And you can even upload your own SVG icon in the case that you have one, okay? I'm gonna explain this later in the case that you want to learn more. Just let me know into the comments so I can do a video about it. But we're gonna use font icons that are the, the normal icons that we already have. We have some some categories right here. We cannot search for the name of the eating, so we can go into the pagination until we can find the icon, or we can use the we can use the categories right here. For example, I would like to have something social. Maybe this group add icon right here. Just a final note, in fact I was wrong, you can search for the icons, okay? You can go to the field right here. When I was this in first place, this did not appear. I don't know why, but if you reload, the search is right here, okay? You search for email, for example. You can see the email icons, okay? So I'm gonna click into the plus button. This is gonna add the icon into my page. And now I have the icon. I can organize the icon, of course. Now we're gonna need to have a look at the right side of our screen, this sidebar. First of all, we have the content. That is the place where the icon is located, okay? We have the style. We're gonna talk about this later. And we have this right here. That is the size and position. We can move the icon to the center of the slider, okay? So middle, middle, gonna be right here middle top gonna be right here you can use your mouse to your keyboard to move the icon across the slider of course we can customize the location right here and we also can do a scene do some additional settings in the case that you need we can control the responsive behavior in the case that you need as well but the most important part, besides organizing the icon and placing it in the place that you want, for example, for me, the preferred place is gonna be next to this text right here. So I'm gonna apply my icon right here. Oh, from over the slider text heading. And now I'm gonna click on the style tab. And from the style tab, 
I would like to change the color of the icon. So SVG color, a dark color, for example. Let me select a dark color. We can change the stroke background, okay, in the case that I want. We can change the background of the icon in the case that you need. It's totally up to you, but I will not do this. But it's good to know that you have an option. We can even upload an image to be the background of your icon. We can change the spacings for the background, the borders. And after having the icon in the color that you want and with the borders you want, you can, for example, let me just apply some borders to You need to choose a style for the borders. And the spacings. Now we have an icon with a border, okay? And besides this, we can make the icon bigger, okay? How to do this? In the widget and H into the size and position to the left sidebar. For example, we can do Two, 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 and two, two, two. And here is the result we got. Let me move the icon better into the page. And here we go. Here is our icon, okay? Same case in the case that we need to decrease the position of the icon and the size of it. Simple, easy, and effective. And it is. Of course, you can apply animations to this icon using the slider revolution animations field. You can make the loop slider. We can change the hover effects. There's a lot of things that you can do with the icons, including special animations. For example, if I click on the icon, I need to open them a link. For example, we do have a video explaining how to do this on the Visual Moto YouTube channel. But for today, it is okay. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check out our Borderless WordPress plugin in order to gain widgets, elements, templates and tools and even pre-built websites importable with a single click. All of this is free. You can install on your WordPress dashboard on WP Dashboard, Plugins, Add New, search for Borderless, click on Install and Activate. Same case for our Enzo WordPress team. In the case that you are in need of an amazing free WordPress team with premium features like even pre-built websites, ready templates and many more options, go to our WordPress dashboard, appearance, themes, add new and search for Enzo WordPress team, okay? It's completely free. And in the case that you are in need of your website up and running faster with premium icons, more image, almost unlimited templates that you can import with a single click, pages, sections icon specs and full support, go to visualmoto.com and purchase the Visual Moto Pass product and go premium. And that is, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I see you tomorrow. All the best!